Well, let's start. Good morning again, everybody. Welcome to this language class. As I told you before, this is, a, this is going to be a practice for speaking and grammar and vocabulary. So today, yes, you can take notes and also you can Google information right now if you need it. So we can work much better some vocabulary. And we're going to have two parts. So this is basically a review. We're going to practice some vocabulary. As you can read here, it's some vocabulary we might be using nowadays, right now. And the connection that we're going to do is with the word lockdown, that you already know the meaning. And this is the game. Well, this is the review. Let me know if can you see this new website I'm opening right now? It's called Answer Garden. Can you see it? No, I see the slide of PowerPoint. Okay, thank you. I'm going to show you this now then. Can you see it now? Yes, yes. Okay. So I'm going to send you this link here. I'm going to copy the link in the chat here in Zoom. But what do you have to do there? Once it is open, you're going to have something like this, something li like this screen. And here it says, type your answer. What kind of answer do you have to type, th to type there? It's related sentences or words to lockdown. So you connect lockdown and what comes to your mind and you can write the answer. I'm not sure if you can do it twice. Maybe only you have one opportunity, so use it right. If you have a second opportunity, that's great, but try to do it, do your best on the first trial, okay? Are you ready? Do you have questions about what you have to do now? This is exercise before the speaking practice. Do you have any do you have any question about what you have to do? Okay, there's a link in the chat. Go to the chat, open the link and answer the question. That's my answer, by the way. So when I hear the expression lockdown, what comes to my mind the first time is stay safe. And I've heard a lot of advices and a lot of words that we are using right now, but it's not only advices that, that what you have to write here. You can write maybe things that you are doing right now at home Maybe something that is happening in, in your house or maybe at school or in the world. Maybe new things that we are doing now or things that we do more now than before. Things that we are using to protect ourselves. New habits that we have at home. Let's see if we have an answer already. Okay, that's good. We have keep safe, quarantine. Mm -hmm. Let's see how many people say this one. One and one, okay, good. Keep writing, it's, if you can write twice or three times, do it. If it's only one, okay, do it, use it wisely. Mm 
Mm -hmm. We have to stay safe, stay home. Good. Keep safe. Again, uh, quarantine again. Uh huh. Antibacterial. That's good. Antibacterial yield. Yeah. So stay healthy. Stay healthy twice, that's good. Indoors, that's good, yeah. We should stay indoors. New habits, you're right. Maybe you can mention some new habits that we have now and we didn't have before. Or maybe we didn't pay too much attention to them before. Virtual classes, yes, good. That's what exactly. That's exactly what we are doing right now. Willpower, uh huh. So if we want to do something, we can, we can get it if we work hard. learn new things yes here we are learning new things everybody's learning new things entertainment uh-huh Let me know if I'm not reading all the answers because apparently I, I still have the same. Uh-huh. Yes, we have to be careful. We have to be more careful now with our health, with our food. You're right. Stay healthy, new habits, entertainment, stay healthy, virtual classes. I love your answers. Taking care of each other, this is a beautiful answer. I don't know who wrote this, but probably you have a big heart. Taking care of each other, yes. Yes, that's what we are doing. Because maybe we are healthy, but maybe people around us are not that healthy, so we, we are in the obligation to take care of each other, especially those vulnerable people. Less risk, uh-huh. I'm trying to find something new that I'm probably missing. And after this, we can continue with the second part of the class. Yeah, I like this one too, less risk. Yeah, we have to reduce the risk. Miss, this is like a collage of words. Yes. Exactly like that. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, so we have lots of answers. Does anyone want me to wait a little bit or we are done here are we done here apparently we are so we can continue i'm going to copy this screen here
And now we complete our PPT presentation, okay? So again, I'm sharing a different screen right now. Can you see it? Yes. 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 Good. So let's continue with the second part of this class. And today we're going to play. This is play and practice, right? It's speaking and play and practice. And it's about this. Each participant, in this case you, are going to have two chances. So it means you play twice. Speak as much as you can. Yes, it's our opportunity to practice English. So speak as much as you can, as much as you want. Try to use some new vocabulary, like the vocabulary we just checked. Do not repeat any other classmates' idea. So if someone said something already, use a different idea, just like you did in the collage with different ideas. And then you choose who is next. It's not me. I'm just going to choose the first person unless there is a volunteer. So in that case, it's okay. And then you choose the next one. You got it? Do we understand all the um, rules? So hard rules. <laughs> you ready? Okay. Means, uh, yes. I'm sorry. Uh, what is what we will talk about? Or if about we, lockdown. Oh, it's okay. about lockdown. Uh huh. So that's why we check some vocabulary first. Okay. But, Thank uh huh. You. Thank you. Who wants to be first? I'm going to choose the first one. Emily, are you ready? Yes, miss. Always ready, Emily. Thank you. Let's continue. Okay, this is the game. Emily, you are going to speak twice or you have two opportunities. I'm not going to tell you what to say. It's going to be on this spin. <laughs> You ready? Yes, but have not a spin now. I'll do it for you, Emily. And this is your question number one. Let me do like this. Question number one. How many face masks do you own? And what color are they? So how many masks do you have? I think I have more than five masks in my house. Uh, there are different colors. Obviously, I have a black one. Black, uh, black uh, I need it because it's black and it's really useful with every clothes that I wear. So then I have a white one. Um, I have a pink, a pink one. That's cute. Um, mm -hmm. Others with some draws because my mom bought me, so it's useful. I'm going to use it. Oh, that's great. So you can combine with different clothes. Yes. Okay, Emily, thank you very much. You have a second opportunity. Let's do it. Okay, this is an interesting question, Emily. <laughs> do you like virtual classes? Why or why not? 
I think I'm in the middle. Uh, sometimes I don't like virtual classes because I don't have, for example, when they are, uh, you know, I sometimes if I have a question, I need to wait for the other class to ask the question, but it's a new learn, it's a new way to learn. So I like it because I'm learning. Okay, that's good. Yeah, we're learning too, you know, every time we make something for you, we are learning like this, the spin thing. It's the first time I use it. Okay, thank you very much, Emily. You tell me who's next. Mm, Christina. Okay, Christina. Thank you, Emily. Are you ready, Christina? Ready or not? No. <laughs> Ready or not, we're going to start. <laughs> Here we go. Okay, Christina, which is the last game you played and what was it about? What well, was the last play? The last game, maybe a video game, or maybe you play with your friends or siblings or online. I don't know. I think I don't remember. I think it was one of cards. Okay, that's good. Um, what is that game about? It's about like the 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 first that has the just one card wins. Okay, thank you. You have a second chance, Christina. Okay, um, let's try a different one, okay? Okay, important question, Christina, and don't tell me that nothing. <laughs> what do you miss about school? No, you're free to answer whatever you want. What do you miss about school? I miss that the the classes hours were um, longer for questions that we have that, like we don't understand or something or some homework that we don't understand. I got it. I miss school too, like a lot. Thank you, Christina. You tell me who's next. Mm. Ariana. Okay, Ariana, you're next. Thank you, Cristina. Bye. Don't leave. Stay there. <laughs> okay, Ariana. Ariana. You yes, there? Honey. Yes, yes. Okay, honey. Your turn. Okay. Okay, what did you do during the long weekend? We didn't have a long weekend, but we have a different one. So can you tell me what did you do during the weekend? Okay, so the day before yesterday, I go to the uh, house of my grand grandmother that she passed away. So it was kind of nostalgic because she was not there um, and I visited it and we had to play with the dogs that they were, they were there and we talked with our aunt and well it was a good day also the reason that it was kind of sad and mm -hmm. yesterday we had a well, good day with my dad because we make him his favorite dessert 
mm -hmm. they were happy. So that's what a museum of what I have. You did a lot of things and I can tell different feelings. Okay, Ariana, uh, you have a second chance. Okay. Good luck. Ooh, this is a big question. What is the worst thing about staying in your house? Oh. Um, I suppose that it's the fact that, well, let me think about it a moment, please. <laughs> no worries. Maybe the fact that I can't visit my family so currently I do uh, before quarantine, but then, I don't know. Uh, I think that that might be the worst thing of staying home all day. Yeah, I understand. Okay, okay thank you, Ariana. You tell me who's next. Okay. Um, Naomi Arevalo. Naomi. Thank you, Ariana. Naomi. You ready? Ready or not, we're okay. going to start. Are you ready, Naomi? Yes, I think. Okay. Okay, um, if you have pets, dogs or cats, how many pets have you got? Mm, I only have one pet. It's a little. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, um, What's his name? It's Lolito. Lolito? Yes, because he's very, very small and, and white. Is it a dog or a cat? It's a dog. Okay, nice to meet Lolito. <laughs> you have other chance now, me. Okay, miss. Okay, we already got this one. Let's try a new one. Okay, so yesterday, about midday, about 12 o'clock or noon, what were you doing? What were you doing in this time yesterday? Maybe yesterday, because of this um, time, you were serving food, you were cooking, you were talking to your family. What were you doing this time yesterday? Mm, I think I, I'm cooking with my grandmother. Um, what were you cooking? Uh, pavo. Okay, turkey. We said turkey. Turkey, turkey, sorry. Uh huh. Turkey and, and a cake. Mm. And, mm -hmm. um, decorate at home. Yeah, that's it. Thank you very much. Who's next? Okay. Who's next now? Uh, let me see, please. Uh, Marixi. Okay, Marioxi, you're next. You ready? Yes. Okay, Marioxi, we try again because we already did this one. We have a lot of questions. Okay. Have you been taking walks? <laughs> Have you been walking? 
Um, yes, uh, but just like around my neighborhood, because, well, my family has the, said that it's, well, it is good to work to my, to work like in at, at 11 a.m. when is the sun shining, that to receive sun, that to receive sun. And so we go walking, but just here around. That's good and perfect. And now that you say that about the sun, it's really good that everybody knows that it's important to get vitamin D. Vitamin D, and the only way you can get it is from the sun, and that's really good to improve your defenses on your body. So that's a good advice, Mariuxi. Thank you. You have other chance. Which kind of movies do you like the most? Action movies or fantasy movies? Fantasy movies. Yes, I like more than like action. That's fantasy. You watch my family. Do you have or... a favorite one? Do you have uh, a favorite mo fantasy movie? Um, That's okay if you don't remember uh, right now. Yeah, I don't remember right now. Don't worry. Who's next, Mario C? Joanna. Ivana? Yes. Okay, Ivana. Oops, are you ready? <laughs> okay, Ivana, are you there? Ivana? Okay, Mariuxi, Ivana is not here. Tell me other name. We have Domenica, Denise, and Jose. Oh, Ivana, you're there. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, I didn't hear you. Have you been playing any games during the lockdown? Um, can, can you repeat, please? Sure. During the lockdown, now that you are in your house, have you been playing any games? Maybe Uno cards or maybe video games? Yes. Okay, which table, one? Table, table games. Oh, good. Do you remember any? Monopoly, maybe? Uh, yes, Monopoly, Cranium, and, and Twister. Twister. Okay. Let's continue with your second question. The same one now. Okay, are you doing exercise every day? Be honest. Of course. Oh, that's great. What do you do? Uh, Running, cardio? Cardio, cardio. Every day in five, five o'clock. Thank you, Ivana. Who's next? Este... Andrea. Este... <laughs> we have Domenica, Denise, and Jose. Denise, Denise. Okay, Denise, come in. Ready or not, here we go. Are you there, Denise? Yes. Okay, Denise. We already had this one. Okay. Wow, this is an interesting question. When do you think the lockdown will end? And do you want it to end? Um, I think that it will end 
uh, don't end, but I hear in the notice that we we go to classes in like in September and like I think that is that <laughs> in their uh, month the quarantine it's going to end. Maybe, yeah, hopefully. And I don't, I obviously like that the quarantine end because I want to see my friends and enjoying the school and learning more. I understand perfectly what you feel. <laughs> Thank you very much, Denise. And because of time, I'm really sorry we have to finish the game. I would love to hear the rest of you, but too bad we're running out of time. So thank you very much, Denise, and everybody and other students for paying attention. Today we had today we had this little practice about some new vocabulary of what's going on around the world, which is the lockdown.